Uh, hello, I'm Aurélie Soulier and today I'll be uh, covering the Moodle community um, section. So today it's community sites only, uh, there's no presentation from Academy. So uh, in terms of look and feel, there's been some updates uh, made to uh, the uh, Moodle.org site. Uh, so we've got the save the dates section has been uh, updated and that's uh, the actual community area at the moment with the Moodle Global uh, uh, displayed in there. Uh, so that's improved UI thanks to Federico and AR and the team uh, and also um, with the, the Moot team working together. Um, as you uh, can see, I think on the next slide, you can see, uh, okay, there's also, uh, there was a, an, an update on the statistics. All of these are incremental uh, improvements and we'll make some additional changes in the next print as well. And the um, um, Moodle User Association banner has been updated to incorporate a picture that they have provided uh, to us next. Oh, here we go. The community stats, they're now appearing there. Uh, there will be improvements, as I've just mentioned, uh, with uh, hopefully uh, over text to explain a bit more about it and, and more um, kind of headers in there uh, to give a little bit more context about the statistics and they might move about in the page as well. Uh, so we're incrementally improving the design for this. Next, please. Uh, so uh, other updates from the community sites with um, the, the welcome text in the tracker when you're not logged in uh, that had the updated text and links and that's been updated. Um, as I mentioned in the goals, we also created and deployed a set of new demo sites uh, that was asked by the community. Uh, so that's sandboxes for other supported Moodle versions. Up to now, we only had the latest version and uh, now we have any supported version and there'll be uh, obviously once we do upgrades uh, uh, upgraded to the all the supported versions uh, this has been also communicated to fit within our goals of of trying to get more in touch for the community whatever the language this has been communicated to the different communities uh, as as many as we could translate within our team so in english spanish french german and italian um, and uh, we are trying to uh, engage a lot of, of users in there and uh, Mary's already reported that uh, it has helped solving um, issues and support issues where people could test um, the um, the different versions issues they had and, and report the problems so that's already um, adding value to, to our Moodle community users. Next please. Uh, so uh, plugins directory improvement just um, a, a, a quick um, uh, brief there. Uh, the first bullet point shouldn't be a bullet point. So high level briefs for the plugins directory improvement have been created and updated. Uh, we've started with the, the most impactful and, and most uh, uh, in impactful and easy to implement hopefully uh, setup so filtering and sorting uh, redesign uh, so all of these are, are high level brief and visual concepts created uh, the redesign of the information available on the results list for the plugins directory the display of the results on um, well, that's kind of how trustworthy a plugin is is what the users wanted to know and improve the experience of adding a plugin in the directory there are other uh, stories being briefed and scoped and then we'll start looking at implementing the first uh, two priority ones. Uh, thank you, next. And uh, if Victor is here, it might be able to cover this better than me. Yes, yeah. yeah. Uh, hello everyone, I'm Victor, uh, developer in the communities sites team. Uh, we are almost finishing the the uh, all the stuff for the download server migration. We've moved from uh, the Apache server that we use in the the current server to a new engine. And the configuration is is ready. Thanks to Edward for the support. Uh, we have the Addays API fully working in the new server as well as the some scripts that we use to auto deploy changes in the external test and other stuff that is hosted in the download server we have to fix some bugs and make some improvement in the local download Moodle plugin that is the one that manage all the all the redirections and 
how the packages are downloaded. We've made some minor changes to the theme model org to customize it for the download site. And we are now working on the migration plan to have everything ready for the for the moment, for the great moment. Thanks to, to Eloy and Eduard for the support. Um, that's me. Thank you, Victor. It's been a, a, a big piece of work that's long outstanding. So it's great to see the progress and, and we're we're working on two options for the actual migration dates at the moment and um, they'll be this decided over the next sprint. Thanks.